Hello there, and welcome to Pixel Junk Monsters Ultimate. My name is Master Mark, and we're going to play some monsters today. Some Pixel Junk Monsters. Now, I've played this game before on the, when it first came out on the PS3. This is actually one of the first PS3 games I ever played. I love this game. I never, I, I don't even think I finished on the PS3. Because I think there were just other games I was playing at the time. What? Well, oh, this this looks better anyway. <laughs> let's, let's stay on this menu for a little bit. So yeah, I I played it on the PS3 and I like fell in love with it. And I think I got to like cl close to the end, and I was I always got stuck on one stage. I was a little younger, so I probably didn't realize what I had to do or what upgrades worked the best. But I'm back. We're back. And this is the ultimate version, which probably has all the DLC and like extra places to go. So I'm super excited for that. And let's get right into it. Um, let's play hardcore. I can't even pick. Let's do regular. Let's play the tutorial stage. It's been a while. Oh, thanks for coming to help us. Our flock's in danger. We'll come soon. Get ready. Move on to one of the trees. Press the action button. You can also move by clicking your mouse on a location. Move next to a tree and click. Oh, so you can also, there is mouse controls in this game, but I'm going to be using a controller for this. A PlayStation 4 controller. <laughs> Here's our little guy running around. These are our little, so we're kind of like a tiki guy with like a shell on our back. Look at my dance. Go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are we going to do now? Whoa. So. This is like our little home base. It has our face on it with zero blue orbs. That would, those come into effect a little later. But and these are our little these are our little friends. They're our defenseless. We need to save them. We are like the tribe leader or something. I don't know. So this is a tower defense game. Enemies will come from a direction, and you have to kill them before they kill your little your little guys actually they kind of look like do they binkies our little baby friends I think they're called chibis there are chibis so we have to protect our chibis from the monsters um so let's say an, a monster gets to the end um it will attack I think one chibi and then disappear. Actually, no, I think if it, one monster gets to the end, he'll eat them one by one. I'm not sure. From what I remember, I think it takes, it's a one for one situation. And when you come to a tree, you come up to this like ring menu. Actually, I'm going to pick this one. Oh, and sometimes when you go over trees, they'll drop coins. There's a run button, I think. What's the run button? You can stop by pushing in both, um, the, the trigger buttons on top. We can run, I think, oh, we need that. That's the little blue orbs I was talking about. Now we have one. Those are used for like quick upgrades. So let's check the rest of these trees, see if there's any more coins. There's, I think there's like a random chance uh, there can be coins. And that you can only check trees once per level. So this one's red. This one's red. Red means you've already checked it. This is important in like the later levels. Not so much right now. This is just the tutorial. So this is our map. The bottom left, you can see a little house and then the waves. So there's like a little minion guy in the middle and then a minion guy way on the right. And when you start the level, it'll like slowly progress to the left. And that's like how much time you have left to defeat the wave you're on. We have one blue orb at the bottom right. We have 250 gold coins and we have 20 GBs. So, this is our ring menu. You use left and right to go through the ring. The only thing we can build right now, the only thing we can build right now is an arrow tower. So, boom. Pick arrow tower, it spends the gold, builds the tower. Great, you made a tower. Watch as it automatically attacks monsters. And there's a monster down. It doesn't look too scary, but... Oh! 
pick up coins, drop monsters drop coins, you can use the coins to build more towers. Like this. Wave two. Here comes some more. After each wave, you'll get bonus coins. You'll notice each tower has a flag. The flag represents the upgrade the tower currently has. So they're both blue or like light blue turquoise right now. If you stand on a tower, it'll show you the radius it can attack from and your little guy will do a dance. Our little tiki man. And it'll slowly build up the little bar on the tower and when it gets to the top, it upgrades. Just gets more damage and range. And gems are used to research new towers or quick upgrade towers. I forgot they research as well. Got some spiders coming up next. So generally, you kind of want to be on a tower at all times. Each upgrade takes longer than the last. So you kind of want to get the coins, go back into a tower, and keep upgrading. But this is a tutorial, so we're going to go build a new tower over here. We get another ring wheel. We can pick, you know, do we want anti-air, or arrows, or cannons, or teslas, or mortars. Mortars and like Teslas and the, the lasers. Actually, the top four here. Well, that's not true. Actually, I was gonna say these are like the top tier, but cannon, cannon. I thought was pretty basic. Like arrow and cannon. I think you start with. Maybe it's the tutorial. Let's just follow the story. It wants us to buy the anti-air. Let's buy the anti-air. Okay. We can build a new tower in the ring menu. So let's put it. Um, here. This is good for air. So you see at the bottom, there's like those little guys, little minions with like the wings on top. So they're a little faster, but have less health generally. And the anti-air is pretty good at taking them out. It fires in like bursts. And the arrows can also hit them. But I think sometimes they can miss. It just depends on the enemy. Build another one of those. More monsters. Yep, it's just telling us the monsters at the bottom. Shows you the icon. I'm gonna upgrade this uh, arrow tower again. Because, remember what I said, the flag shows like the upgrade level, the tower. Oh, you're kidding me. Oh, so you can get hit. I did forget about that. So we're going to lose one. That's okay. It's just a tutorial. So we kind of want to get these upgraded. The tutorial is not really telling us that yet, but I'm, it's from playing from experience. I know that's very important. So you can sell it by bring up another wheel and walking on pressing the action button. We can upgrade it using the blue orbs. But let's upgrade this one. Boom. It's already red. You generally upgrades are good, but they're not required. Let's see. If you want to upgrade your tower in a hurry, you can select the upgrade. Yeah, it spends gems. Or um wow, these guys are strong. What the heck? Why are they so strong? So we're gonna lose a couple guys here actually that's okay i haven't played this game in a while it's just a tutorial okay what else can we build should probably get the cannon next but i think we're gonna need another arrow actually let's work on upgrading this one so you can actually get hit by the enemies i forgot about that they hit you, you drop a bunch of gold. I don't know what if it's half or just like a percentage. But don't want to get hit. So there's a big monster coming for the final wave. Get a new selection of music. The music in this game is really good, by the way. So 
because those towers are air in the front, they will not attack. These towers will. We just spend all our orbs here. There we go. Dink, dink, dink. This one should be able to take care of him. Dink. One more. One more. You can do it. Yeah. Great. All the monsters down the forest is safe. And we can move on to the next area. It's a very basic tutorial. Shows you how many you lost and the, the monster stats. We got one rainbow. Now we've cleared the tutorial and I can three. Yeah, this is what I was talking about. I was, I was like, why is the cannon locked already? I don't remember the cannon being locked. That's because it's not. So th these are the three basic towers that we'll use throughout the whole game. And you can upgrade to the other ones later, like the Tesla and the mortar. And, and those are very, you, some levels have a lot of like minions. Some have a lot of monsters that come in the air. Some of them have a lot of like rock monsters would have a lot of armor and different towers are good for different things. So the cannon is good for cannon is AOE, AOE ground. So if there's a lot of little minions, the arrow will be able to take out a couple, but it won't be able to take out a huge group. That's what the cannons are for. The arrows are for just general defense. They can attack everything and do damage, like moderate damage to everything. Um, like the rock monster say Esau, it does an okay amount of damage, but it could be better, well, you know, with the cannons. And like, oh yeah, the cannons also do go through armor a little bit. But they can't attack air. That's what the air towers are for. Because the aero towers are good, but the anti-air are the best for cleaning out air. We've cleared one stage with a perfect record. I don't think that was a perfect record. I think it just gives you one to begin with. We can either go up or down. It shows you the, um, the difficulty of the stage. So this is medium, shortcut. This is the tutorial. We cannot go this way. We need seven rainbows. You get a rainbow by beating a stage. And I think with a perfect score, I think. So let's do easy one. Here we are. Okay, so there's no, there's no downtime like the tutorial. So we we'll want cannon go. Hurry, we want to check the trees for coins. There's a random chance. Yep, there's one. Extra, uh, extra gems early on is very good. And just money in general. Money does expire in this game, so you do have to kind of go pick it up within a reasonable amount of time. We've our tower. There's some air coming. Like some little guys with wings. So let's get um an air here. Because it covers the whole entire like woods right here. And later on there'll be shortcuts that some minions can take, like the flying ones. They're kinda like acorns. Let's call them the flying acorns. Sometimes the acorns will fly over obstacles, the ones like the little minions and the rock monsters can't go over. Like there might be water or something that most of the minions have to go around like on bridges and stuff but the air the little acorn guys they just fly right over they don't care they're like screw that we're gonna take a shortcut so we got spiders up next spiders are fast so they kind of counteract um the cannons a little bit just because they're so fast uh they're, and they're usually kind of separated so the cannons will hit a couple, but they won't hit all. So you kind of want to get some arrows in there as well. Let's just upgrade this one. Let's spend a, spend a gem. Oosh. Cannons are slow. So we want to go down here and put some more. Uh, let's get two in here. Put one here just in case, because I feel like one or two are just gonna get past. No money. I like me money. Yeah, this should be okay. And every map's a little different. Sometimes it's good to have a lot of small towers. 
that aren't very upgraded. Sometimes it's better to have a lot of upgraded towers. Are you kidding me? Let's see if we can get him. Probably not. Oh, sell this. What a waste. Oh, perfect. No. Let's get back to dance. Do the dance under the tower. Upgrade the tower. Low cannon. Boom. Okay. It's a level three. It goes light blue, yellow, red, I think purple, and then like orange, I believe. Like I said, it's been a long time since I played this. So I'm going to be a little rusty. And towers also gain experience. Like, you can upgrade them through a gem, you can dance on them to level them up, or they, if they just do damage, they'll upgrade on their own. They gain experience from killing stuff. Okay. Get these two coins. Let's get back to upgrading. Here comes a rock monster. Remember, they have a lot of armor. Let's get another cannon here. Let's get two cannons, actually. We have tons of money. You don't want to just hang on the money in this game. Let's go. Oops, I did not want to do that. Oh, I sold it too, so I can't get that tree back. Why did I do that? Oh, no, it's back. I had it, uh, the, the ring on auto sell by accident. Whoops! Didn't mean to do that. Uh, stupid rock monsters. Back to dance? Yeah. Yeah, we're upgrading. We're dancing. I can dance all day. I can dance all day. Let's see, we got 19 left. We got we got two we got a lot of money. I should really put some more stuff down. Okay. Let's get some more arrows in here. Let's get upgrading. Yeah. It's a shame you can't spend money to upgrade, but that's not how the game works. Actually, there's some coins up here. I need those. Just a barrage of cannonballs. Come on. Yes. Okay, we got 10. We can upgrade. There's a little icon down there. Shows us uh, we can get the Tesla Tower and also the little home we live in flashes. This also pauses the game. So Tesla releases a high-powered electrical attack on all nearby monsters, uh, only ground. It has high power, low speed, low range. So it's, this is very much an AOE tower. Let's see. So this one is laser tower does air. Mortar is it's basically like an upgraded cannon. They're very expensive, but they're very powerful. It has a widespread. So the Tesla oh Tesla only attacks one monster. Wait, all nearby monsters. Speed is very low. Let's get a Tesla. Let's see what it does. I'm sitting here trying to like, like, hmm, what can we do? What does this do? What does it just get one? Let's put it here. We have the money. Ooh, we need more anti-air. Put two here. Let's actually upgrade this one. Oh, we don't have any orbs left. That's okay. Remember, the Tesla's only ground, so it won't attack these the acorns. 
these little acorns. Okay, we got a red one now. The damage and attack speed goes up when you upgrade a tower. Money. Gotta grab that cash. There's only one left. This one should be able to take care of it. One more. Okay, thank God. He almost didn't get him. I was like, please don't do this. Don't do it. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna upgrade this purple one to the next level just to see. I believe they get some sort of I don't know if it's a substantial upgrade but something happens when you get them to max level I know that much we slink in here and get some of this money I'm poor I need this actually we're kind of rich Oh yeah, see when you upgrade to the third it costs a lot, but it has like the arm with the power. The power! And uh, we're coming up on wave 8. Now you can see down there we have some rock monsters coming and then we have some, some like giant golden statue with four eyes coming. That is a stage boss. So in the tutorial we had the rock monsters kind of like the boss, but they're actually not that bad. They're just very tanky and slow. So we're about to upgrade this purple to a uh, orange, a black. Ooh, and you cannot upgrade past black. Oh, and the tower becomes gold. That's what happens. So we probably want to upgrade these a little bit because the boss is coming. So we got another purple. I should not have to touch the rock monsters, but we need this money. Need that money. Oh yeah, I forgot the little blue orbs fly back to the base. Boom. Ooh, Tesla Tower's online. Tesla Tower online. Zap. So you can either upgrade through normal means by like uh, dancing underneath and having the towers just do a lot of um damage hold on let me get some more teslas in here okay teslas have very low range so you kind of want to squeeze them in like here i'm just gonna buy as many as i can go for another one down here now we can spend Boss is, that boss is really slow. It's like a golden idol or something. So while it's doing that, we can actually upgrade some of these towers at the bottom. So we got a red. Let's upgrade this yellow to a red. Come on, Tesla Towers, do your thing. Zap. There's a lot of health. Actually, they're doing a lot of damage. Here come the cannons. Zap, zap, cannons. Oh yeah, he's dead. There's no way. Dink. Look at you. You're dead. Do the dance. Woo! Give me all that money. We got some his nose or his head. Just a face in the crowd. Just got an achievement. So we did not get a rainbow because we lost one person. But that's okay. I can always go back and get the rainbow. And we can do, let's do easy too. So it goes right into it. No downtime. Hurry. Okay, let's get a cannon. Splitting up a little bit, which is fine. Let's get an arrow in. Like, 
You gotta kind of think ahead, too. I can probably make this one an arrow. Wow, we have some rock monsters coming up right away. Tough guys. It's generally not a good idea to use gems unless it's like the later in the game and it's just hard. So you have to upgrade just, just to survive. I'm going to try to go for a rainbow on this one. Upgrade this. Uh, let's make this another cannon. The path's going to split here. Let's do that. Let's get upgrading this one. Look at you, you're made of rocks! You dummy! Bonehead! Did I imagine the music is nice in this game? It's just very, like, nice to listen to. Boop, 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 Hopefully that there's enough cannons. But it doesn't really matter. You kidding me? Uh, see, this is my problem. I never spend enough money. Actually, hold on. Let's retry. So I do want the rainbow. Taste the rainbow. Okay. So what did we learn? There are spiders in the third round. They are fast. If we wish to get a rainbow, we have to get rid of all the spiders. Wow, that was a nice shot. Good job. Let's get another arrow. Um, not there, but like here. Let's start upgrading the arrow, because I know the mortars, or the cannons, will be able to take care of the rock monsters, no problem. But it's those spiders. <laughs> it's the spiders! The dangerous, you know? The spiders. Hey, rock man, you got some grass on your head. Oh god, I tripped. I broke my ankle and I dropped all my cash. Alright. Uh, arrow. They seem to all go up last time, so I'm gonna put two arrows there. I'm gonna get this one up. There's a coin over there. Gimme, 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 gimme. I thought you could run in this game, but I'm maybe I'm misthinking. Yes. Good show. Yeah, there we go. Sometimes arrows, if the enemies are close enough, sometimes the arrows hit more than one. Just nice. I like that. Now, eventually, they will split up, though, because there's two paths to the end. I should get another arrow here. Oh, that's gotta hurt. Boom, boom. Die, minions, die. Let's get this one upgraded. I have a feeling we're gonna need it. Let's just save up gems and get, um, let's see. So I'll probably get Tesla Towers again. They're just good. You can also set up defensive measures. Defensive. Defensive measures. Defensive measures by just like putting some arrows in the back. So it's just like insurance. You know, you, they probably won't get back there, but you never know. Better safe than sorry. Better safe than sorry. Oh, anti air. Remember, these have a lot of range. You kind of put them... Probably put one here. Upgrade, upgrade. We need to upgrade. 
it's probably a good idea to build one of each. Get them to a pretty good level. Because one red or purple tower do a lot more damage than one light blue or yellow. You picking up what I'm putting down? Um, let's get this one air, air tear at the bottom to yellow. We can we can buy the Tesla now. We can also buy what the heck is that? Run, run. Pause the game. What is that? Laser. Oh, that's the laser tower. So that's good for air. But I don't know. Let's get just get Tesla. Tesla's always a safe bet. Remember, Tesla's very short range. Probably want it like here and here. We actually don't have any cannons in the back. Oh my god! Come on. Yes. No! Are you kidding me? No, we don't get the rainbow. Oh, that's so aggravating. See, I'm, I'm, I'm doing it again. I have 400 in the bank. Why? Why am I sitting on so much money? Ugh. Gonna have to redo that one. No, look. I'm doing it again. Look. We need cannons. More cannons. This can be a Tesla. This is close. Oh, we put a cannon. Oh, I actually don't have enough money for a cannon anymore. See, they're starting to go down. That's what I was worried about. Let's go for just a generic cannon there. Okay. Oof, it's getting a little tough. Oh, wait, I, there's the boss, though. If we had just maybe upgraded another a tower by one or two, or put another air tower, we probably would have gotten a perfect. Okay. Let me actually spend... Let's spend a gem here. Get that attack speed up. And it tells you what upgrade they get next. So see it gets range. This gets attack speed. Damage is like the little, little arm. With the power. Has a, a glow. Okay. Probably gonna get another Tesla here. If we can just get him like right in here, that would be good. Oh my God, his face. Dance, you fool. We can actually afford another cannon. Uh, let's assume he's going up. No, let's assume he's going down. Because with my luck, he'll go down. That's not where all my good towers are. Let's upgrade this one. We have two purple Tesla towers. That should... They should be able to do a pretty good amount of damage. Remember, you don't want to be just standing there, you know, just flip flopping around. You want to be upgrading. Upgrade that shit. Oh. Dink, dink. Okay. Like almost a fourth of his health gone. Okay, here come the Teslas. Almost halfway. He's halfway. Thank God he's so slow. We done it. Come here, you. Yeah. Got your nose. It's probably his head, but no, we lost one. So we get a little forest, meaning we beat it, but we didn't get a rainbow. Because 
Gosh dang it, I'm holding on to too much money early on. But this looks like a good spot to stop in the forest for now. Next episode, we'll move on to easy three and we'll probably finish the left side first then move on to the right side. And then once we finish both ends, we can go into the middle and up to the volcano. I don't think I've ever been to the volcano, so that would be really interesting to see. But yeah, my name is Master Mark. I'll see you guys in the next video. If you liked watching this, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.